This solar light is slightly different from the ones that I made before. Before I just used to use whatever inductor I had lying around. This time I ordered a 47 micro Henry inductor and I also added a 1N4148 diode and I'm using 7 LEDs. They're just 3mm bright white LEDs, nothing special. And then the chip is this small job here which is the QX5252F which is used in many of these garden lights and that makes it possible to have a solar light that is very small and uh, basically one chip does all. And this configuration is a copy from Mr. Freddy W1. He had this one here before. Uh, when I was making mine I, I never added the dial Maybe the dial adds to the um, the, the uh, pulsing and the buildup of the energy, and maybe that's what makes it last a little longer and uh, make for a better and brighter light. So I just finished soldering. I haven't attached the solar panel yet, and I was eager to test it to make sure it works. This is a Anytime uh, battery is similar to the any loop is 2300 MA. It's also the pre-charge type, and the voltage is about 1.28. So when you or when I connect it, you can see how bright it is. I don't know how long the battery will last, but the other ones that I made. I used two of these batteries or any loop and they last all night and I was using like a 6 to 6 volt or so uh, solar panel usually around the ones I use are like 300 MA, 200 MA so I just want to make sure they can last through the night you might ask why bother making these light well when you make them your own you can uh, Make them the way you want to make them. This is the QX5252 chip and it has four pins. Uh, pin 1 is solar plus, pin 2 battery plus, pin 3 is uh, all negative and pin 4 connects to your LED uh, through a diode and the conductor or inductor is connected uh, to pin 2 and pin 4 and that's it there's no uh, nothing complicated about it so the solar panel is connected to the solar panel positive and then the negative for the solar panel connects over here and then the battery is the same deal battery connected to your AA rechargeable positive and negative and that's it. You don't have to uh, do anything else.